Everybody, this is Dak Kid Douglas, and I'm making this quick video to show you all what Life in a Tent sent me. We had a long, we've had a long conversation exchange on Twitter. I started questioning him about the death threats he sent to people, and his video about Japan, which you all know by now. This is the delightful message he sent me. You've got 24 hours to quit your crap before I dox your ass and contact your parents. Zai, now I said shut up and buzz off. That's very nice. Essentially, he threatened to reveal my personal information. And assen he essentially threatened to reveal my personal information. Or as it's more commonly known, dropping docs. <sighs> this guy is just... Uh, I'm, just so you know, I've reported this to Twitter. Not only is this guy dangerous, but he's just mentally ill. Seriously, who the hell threatens someone? To friends to reveal someone's personal information just because they call you out on your wrongdoings. That's that's really pathetic to me. And this is well, this is another thing that he said that really ticked me off. Ticked me off. Thumbs up for Epic Earthquake and Epic Coney 2012. Just you wait for another quake. I'll be all over that. Just watch. Get mad. Oh my God, this guy's so stupid. Seriously. No wonder why people hate this guy, it's because of stuff like that. This guy's a scumbag. This guy clearly hasn't changed, and he's still the same old douchebag that he was a year ago. And thank God he got banned off of YouTube. And you know what, I hope Twitter bans him all. I hope he gets banned from Twitter, because it's not right to reveal someone's personal information. But the, and then with the stuff he's posted on here, you know, death threats or whatnot, it's just it's mind-boggling. Seriously, just because people like Happy Cabby or people that the reply will call you out does not give you the right to threaten their lives. And you know what, Life in a Ten, you're a freaking scum. You, you know what, you're you're a scumbag. And I hope you burn in hell. And I hope God has a special place for you in hell. And you know what, let me say this: you do not threaten to reveal someone's personal information on the internet. Now, granted. I'm a cool guy, I don't take a lot of things too seriously, but when someone threatens, my pers threatens to reveal my personal information and draw up my dogs, I take it seriously. You do not threaten someone, you do not threaten to reveal someone's personal information on the internet. Let me repeat that. You do not threaten to reveal someone's personal information on the internet. That is something you do not do. Even if you don't like the person, it doesn't give you the right to draw up their dogs. That is dangerous and that is wrong. Are you that stupid life in a tent? Or is your mind cl clouded with just ab is your mind clouded with absolutely delusional crap from people like Happy Cabby and the reply girl? Do you honestly not think before you say anything on the internet? Seriously, man? You're absolutely pathetic. And you tell me to grow up and get a life? Dude, you're like 27. I'm 17. And I even have more of a life than you. You're absolutely pathetic, internet tough guy who threatens people just because they call you out. You have a little temper tantrum. Whenever someone calls you out on your wrongdoings, you're a pathetic pile of crap and I will be burning hell. And this is what I think of you. My middle finger goes up to you. <sighs> okay, now I'm calm. This is Dr. Douglas signing out. Deuces.